Greetings and salutations YouTube, it's Hadrian here. How's everyone doing today? I hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Happy New Year everyone. I know today is actually the eve of New Year's Eve, but you guys aren't going to see this until after New Year's. And this, if you already saw the title of the video, is a very, very exciting moment for me. Um, this package just came in the mail right now I know I look like a hot mess but I just threw on a hat and I wanted to do this unboxing right now because I cannot wait and I really just wanted to open it up and see it this package came to me all the way from Japan now um, the my favorite times to go um, on to eBay and do like some online shopping is Christmas Eve Christmas Day and then New Year's Eve and even New Year's Day as well. Um, I feel like a lot of people aren't online checking to see um, like their bids and whatnot on eBay. So it's a lot easier to get a really good deal. And this is one of my Holy Grail bags. I have been wanting one so badly for so long. You guys know my obsession with handbags. And this fulfills one of those dreams. So inside this, this box in my hot little hands is one of those items so I'm gonna open it up with you guys this is gonna be a moment that we're gonna share together because I am beyond excited I actually ordered a couple other things online as well but this just happened to be the thing that came first I don't know why they all didn't come together but they're from different sellers and from different places so but this one oh is really something special and I have to just do a video dedicated to it anyway so this is all we're going to be opening but it's going to be a good one all right can you guys do you get you guys can already see the little these on there you guys see what's in my hot little hands right now oh my gosh I am so excited now this is definitely a pre-loved piece and I got it at such an amazing price um, I don't remember off the top of my head but it was around $600 but for a Chanel double flap now this it looks like it's black but it's actually navy and what I love about this bag is that it looks a little bit worn. I don't know if that's weird, but this is definitely a vintage style. It's still, um, this is the double flap. Oh, I love it so much. Look at this closure. It's so cool. It's like pointy. Can you see that? So, yeah, it spins and it opens. And it's actually in really good condition. It just needs a little leather conditioner. But look at that. Oh, and this hardware is amazing. What well, I, this is actually, um, I've been wanting a Chanel bag exactly like this. I've been dying for this style because they don't make the uh, classic double flaps with this hardware anymore, I believe. And this is the re this is like the reissue hardware, and I love the this hardware because it's just so clean. I just think it looks like jewelry, and I think it's so pretty. It's so beautiful, and I am completely dying for this bag. And I love that the. <laughs> It's weird, but I love that the hardware is kind of faded because I don't really, I don't know. I would still love one with like shiny gold hardware as well, but I love that it looks like vintage and gorgeous. You guys know my obsession with like vintage bags. So I just feel like just needs a good conditioning. There's a little scuff right here on the front. So you guys know that I'm going to be doing handbag rehab for this for sure, but... Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm like dying. 
Look at the interior, it's stunning. Again, the interior just needs a little leather conditioner, but other than that, it's pretty good. And it has like a little thing right there. I don't know what this is. We're gonna have to get into it later on with a handbag rehab, but I just wanna make sure the little snap closure, the snap button does work beautifully. And what's important too is that the turn lock works, which I'm really excited about, and everything else is just perfect for me. I am so, 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 so excited. The back pocket. There are, like, again, like, some scuffing around the corners, but, again, I am not too worried about that. We're just going to clean it up, and it's, oh, look at this bag, you guys. I just love that the hardware, like, it's aged, and, like, it's, like, kind of like a, like a brushed light gold. It's almost kind of like that Kate Spade hardware that's, like, in between silver and gold, so it's, like, not too bright. I just really like it, and it's a navy, and I love navy. Okay, I just wanted to film some close-ups of the bag. So, here is the bag itself. The leather is actually in pretty good condition. There are just a couple scuffs right here, like, along the front right there. And I have a little wear on the corners. But they're not horrible. I think a little leather conditioner will pretty much mask all of that. So, there's the bottom. The corners. This stitching is still intact and very strong on the sides. There's the top, here's the other side, and then the hardware is, I kind of like that looks, it looks like this part is more silver and then this one is more gold, it kind of gives it like, it looks, they actually have those bags where the hardware is like half gold and half, yellow, half um, silver, which I think is really cool. And then here is the first flap, and then here we have, this is the zipper, the mademoiselle it pocket I think is what it's called. And then there, it's a line in the maroon. Zipper still works well. Then here, there's like a little wear right here. I don't know what this is. Probably from the chain. And then it, there's also a little wear right here as well. But other than that, this le the, like the inner maroon leather is gorgeous and in great condition. Right here, the leather is really great as well. Nothing too notable with the damage. There is like some wear right there from the button. And then there is the interior Chanel Paris. But then right here it says, the made in France right there. Here is the hardware on the underside of the Chanel, the clasp right there. So there's that, beautiful. And what I really like too about this bag is I'm obsessed with this turn lock. See how it's like pointy? I think that's so cool. And then it spins beautifully. And this hardware also, it's just like the reissue. It has, I don't know if you can, it'll zoom in. You see how there's like in the middle link, there's like a little design in the middle links. I think that is a beautiful detail and I am completely obsessed. And again, I love how there's like worn colors on this. It's like kind of silver, kind of gold. Like I love that. And you guys know that I'm a sucker for anything nautical, so that the fact that this is like navy and like kind of gold and silver is killing me because it's so amazing and that's like totally nautical themed. So I'm completely dead over this bag. Here is the bag. The stitching is superb. And there's the, the maroon lining is inside of there. I don't know if you guys can see that too well. But... Ugh, you guys, I am so happy. I wonder if my phone... Okay, my phone doesn't fit. Maybe without the case. Okay, it's gonna fit, but it's gonna, like, explode. So no to that. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna have to keep the thing inside. But I already want to start using it. Like, my phone with the case will definitely fit inside there. It's, and there's still, like, a ton of space in there for, like, other stuff as well. So I'm super duper excited. I don't know if my case is going to be like, going to damage the leather. I don't know. We'll see. 
but uh, so beautiful. Love it. Gorgeous. My only thing is that the strap is not long enough to wear a crossbody, but I mean, just carry it like this. And it's amazing. Oh, I'm so happy. I'd probably just like wear it around my neck or something ridiculous. Yes. I feel like Flava Flav and he wears like a giant clock. I'm just gonna wear this Chanel like this. <laughs> oh, it smells so good too. Oh my gosh. Okay, now I'm not wearing a hat and my hair looks crazy. I'm probably gonna wear my bag like this. Or like, you guys know that I'll like throw anything over my back as long as it fits. And I would carry it probably like this. Like, how cool is that look? I don't know, I just feel like that's like a fun look. And like, this kind of looks like a piece of jewelry. I don't know, am I weird? But look at that. And then if I want to reach into it, I can just be like, oh, let me just reach into here. Grab there. Stick my phone inside. Oh, I love it. I'm so excited. But, oh. You guys, I don't like at a loss for words. I am so, so, so excited for this bag. I don't even know what to say. Um, but here it is, my brand new pre-loved Chanel double flap in navy, gold hardware, beautiful, stunning, ugh, feels amazing. And at like $600, this was a steal. I'm super duper excited. And... I cannot wait to start using it. This is a, an amazing bag to start the new year off with. And this has definitely been one of my holy grail pieces. I've been wanting a Chanel Classic double flap for the longest time. Or even a single flap. Just like the Chanel Classic in general. And this is in the, like, the large size. And, yeah. So now my life is pretty much complete. If I could only get my hands on maybe like a jumbo and of course a walk and maybe one of the smalls but right now i'm very very happy so thank you guys again for hanging out with me today and watching this video and you guys know they're going to be seeing a lot of this bag because it is beautiful it is stunning and i'm over the moon with oh i'm so excited i can't wait to condition it up and make it look gorgeous so make sure that you guys subscribe so you guys can see that video. And I just wanted to thank you guys again so much for all your support. This whole year has been amazing with you guys. I cannot even imagine my life without you guys in it. And you guys just make me so happy. And thank you guys again so, so much for hanging out with me and watching the unboxing. I feel like we all got a new Chanel today. So thank you guys so much. I love you immensely. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye. Tierna Zabet. It's kind of a cute looking bag. Ooh, carts are coming out. Each and every.